All right, guys, Christmas is coming up. It's just right around the corner. We're now in November of 2022. Here is my top 10 picks for gifts for nurses. A lot of fours in that. In any case, I'm going to run through these fairly quickly, not go into a lot of explanation, but these are my top 10 favorite nurse gifts for Christmas. Number one, my favorite tool of all time, the Pulse Ox. Get a good one. Get the ones that does the wavies. Shows you when they're on the finger real good. I like those. They're pretty awesome. They tell a lot of information in that little bitty box. A lot of things that I need quickly, pulse, hand oxygen saturation. I love those things. They are phenomenal. You're not looking at spending a whole lot for a good one, probably under about $20, but be sure to get a good one. Don't get one that's like $5. Get a good one. Number two on this list, the stethoscope. I have the hardest time saying that word, stethoscope. Should need no explanation. It's the thing you listen to people with. They work great. If you are getting one for a nurse, get a good one. Get a good one. You should look at spending minimum, minimum $45. I mean, you find one that's 10 to 20, just don't even bother. Do not even bother. Them things are gonna be hard in your ears. You're not gonna be able to hear nothing. They're not gonna have any give in, in it's just, they're, they're terrible. Just, just go ahead and spend the extra couple dollars. $45 should be your minimum because they get uncomfortable. You wear them a lot. I mean, you know. Well, you may not know if you're looking at this as not a nurse. A good stethoscope, $45 minimum. Minimum good, good stethoscope. Scrubs, scrubs is next on this list or a gift card for scrubs. My personal favorite at this moment is Wonder Wink. I'm actually currently wearing a set of Wonder Wink scrubs. They just fit the best, in my opinion. The mediums are medium, the larges are large, and the smallers are smallers. I mean, Wonder Wink seems to get it. Cherokee used to be good, but I had a bad problem, problem of ripping the pockets when I would bend down. When I'd bend down and get something, the pockets would rip because I had them stuffed full of stuff. And that just wasn't working. Scrubs or a gift card for scrubs. Number four on this list, a bag. A nurse's bag. This could be a travel bag. This could be a take it to work bag, but a bag. If you want to put things in this bag, it should, it doesn't have to, but should include items like a good thermometer, something that does the temp in less than 10 seconds. I prefer the VIX. The VIX thermometers, they have the little bendy ends, they bend. They're oral thermometers. You could also do uh, one with the gun. Um, but I really don't like those, to be quite honest with you. I don't think they're as accurate as they need to be. Um, thermometer, probably gauze, probably band-aids, probably some sort of blood pressure taking device. If you could get an all-in-one sort of cuff and stethoscope, those are pretty good. You could, in a pinch, use just a stethoscope if you need to. The electric um, blood pressure cuffs would probably be too big for that. They probably just wouldn't work. And you should also include a good pair of scissors and a flashlight. You have no idea how much you would actually use those things, you know, at a ball game or whatever it may be. I mean, just last weekend, somebody asked me to take a blood pressure and I couldn't because I didn't have a bag with me. So a good nursing bag, if, so if you set one up for work, get good quality things. If you set one up for recreational use, private use, personal use, whatever you want to call it, it doesn't have to be tip-top stuff. It just has to be something that can be used in a pinch and get the information that you need. A good bag is phenomenal. Number five on this list, a color match hoodie. What I mean by a color match hoodie is one that matches the color of their uniform. One that is preferably zip up and has pockets. Nurses get cold on them units, especially late at night. And you night shift nurses, you know what I'm talking about. You guys get cold. A color match hoodie. So for instance, if your colors are blue, get a dark blue or a royal blue. Or if your colors are green for whatever reason, get a green hoodie. A color match hoodie. No symbols, no names, nothing on it. Just a simple color match hoodie. Champion used to make a lot of good stuff like that. I don't, they sort of became mainstream. I'm not sure if they do anymore or not. Starter did too. Starter was a good good company that I went with. Uh, a lot of times I don't I don't use them anymore but that's who I went with number six on this list a jacket a good quality nursing jacket 
If you don't want to get them a hoodie or if they cannot wear a hoodie, a good quality nurse jacket is a good idea. Typically not very thick, but full of pockets. I used to know a nurse that wore a jacket just for the pockets. She loved having the extra stuff to put stuff in. Loved, 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 loved having pockets. Number seven on this list, something that you would have to really know this nurse or really have a good, good, good relationship with this nurse because it's most expensive on this list, a smartwatch. Smartwatches are great because they count your steps, they count your pulse, they tell the time, they give you text messages, things like that. Certain units, such as dialysis, which I was on, requires you to not have a cell phone on the unit. If you cannot have a cell phone on the unit, but your kid's school is trying to get a hold of you, a smartwatch is a phenomenal investment. Very expensive though, get a good one. Get one that's actually going to work. Good smartwatches are expensive, but not too bad. On Again, on the cheaper end of things, coming in at number eight, I just like doing my eights like that. I like doing my eights like that. On number eight is a good custom tumbler. Get them something that's personalized and a good tumbler that can hold hot and cold drink. Some like coffee, some like cold water, some like cold Coca-Cola, some like cold coffee. You know, whatever they want to put in it. A good custom tumbler. You know, pick a school that they went to. Get them a tumbler there. Get a big one. Get a good one. Get a quality one. Tervis is a good company and they do have custom custom deals walmart also makes custom tumblers as well i've had good luck out of them but i don't like them because the bottom falls out yeah if you've ever had a walmart tumbler you know what i'm talking about the bottom for whatever reason the bottom falls out number nine sort of pertains to one group but any nurse really could could have these but the night shift nurses will appreciate this and that is blackout curtains your circadian rhythm gets messed up, your sleep schedule gets messed up, you have a hard time going to bed, whatever it may be, and you can only sleep like during the day for like six hours, if you're lucky. A good set of blackout curtains will help you phenomenally. A good set of blackout curtains, a good set, a good set, a good quality set. Come on now. Don't just tell them to put temple on the windows. It just looks bad. It just, it just looks bad. However, I'll say, I did work with a nurse who preferred <laughs> the aluminum pool on the windows as opposed to anything else. It just it, it's a bad look. Blackout curtains looks good. And number 10 on this list, number 10 is something that I personally hope to get, and that is nothing at all related to nursing. Get them something as far from nursing as possible. Get to know them. Get them something that they enjoy. If they have a hobby, get them something that goes with that hobby know you nurse don't just get them some crap because of where they work no get them something cool something they will enjoy that's not nursing related not pizza either we're tired of pizza we are tired of pizza but something just anti-nursing related something that is related to them and on a personal level something that they want you know could be good for you hope it helps thank you much